Hey, so in this video recording, I want to talk about why I barely press the like button on most women's videos. Because to be honest, most of these women out here nowadays, they're living a double life. You don't really know what they're doing unless they tell you tell you their name and they have like an Instagram or an OnlyFans page or you know Instagram and all that. The reason why I don't press the like button on most women's pages is because most women of today, they're living a double life. So a woman on YouTube, per se, she could see, seem all innocent and sweet. You know, she could be saying all the right things, but you really don't know what's going on behind closed doors with her. Most of these women now are living a double life. So, you know, when you come across a woman on YouTube and you see her page, you know, she could be saying all the right things, you know, tickling your ears, you know, basically just saying, saying things that you may agree with, like this one lady, um, on YouTube, uh, she has a TikTok page, um, but she she said that she was a ballet teacher. Uh, I'm seeing this all across my um, my social media feed on YouTube. The um, some of these people on YouTube, where they're talking about her, um, you know, you know, and and you see her, you know, sh she comes across all sweet and innocent, but. When I, when Rango TV reactions came on and sh and he really exposed her for what she was really doing, you know, basically quote unquote living a double life, you know, she has she has an OnlyFans page or I don't know if she has an OnlyFans page, but she has an Instagram where like she's like scantily clad, uh, you know, breast showing showing off her body, um, you know, and, and I admit most women who have a social media page, um, they're, they're all, they're all on there to get attention. Um, all of them are, including me, but I at least want to portray to my audience that, um, you know, that I have a different state of mind um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the point I'm trying to get across in this recording, but yeah, basically, you know, she was saying like, oh yeah, she was trying to um, get these young girls under control and, you know, they weren't listening to her. You know, and, and when you see her and when you hear her voice, she, she seems all sweet and innocent, right? But... Um, her other life is to, um, basically get attention from, um, male viewers, which is what every woman wants, I guess, per se, but, I mean, I mean, if you're gonna act all sweet and innocent and, and telling people, like, hey, you know, this is what I think, like, um, you know, in reality, it's like, um, she, she doesn't show any, like, any true moral value be, uh, behind her words because, you know, she has an Instagram page where, like, she's just, she's trying to get male attention in any way she can. So this is why I don't press the like button on most women's channels when they, when they go on their live and they discuss something. You know, even though, even though what they may be saying is true, 
Um, even though you may like the topic or discussion that they may be talking about, they, they may say some truth behind what they're saying, but in reality, they're living a double life. You know, they, they, have, a, they have a secret only pa OnlyFans page. They have an Instagram page to where they're scantily clad, and all they want is male attention. This is this is what I'm this is what I mostly get from um, from women's YouTube channels. They you know they always have they always have like a backup channel or some site somewhere to where they're trying to get any kind of validation from from anybody basically. <sighs> it's it's really messed up. And you know, I'm you know, I'm grateful that I even get a little bit of attention on my channel. Like I'm grateful that I even get some sort of attention from somebody on my channel. Because um like I said in the previous recordings before that I put on my channel, most women out here now are just out to get the bag. You know, whether, whether it be showing off their body or, you know, showing feet pics or whatever. This is, this is what the modern women of today are doing now on social media. They live double they live double lives and they don't want anybody to know about it. And this is why this is why men on online are doing their diligent research. They're they're doing they're doing their due diligent research on these women. And I don't blame them. It's like you can't you can't really trust what they say because you know, like I said, they're living a double life, you know what I mean? They're not, they're not, they're not truly who they say they are. I don't know. I don't know. I, my channel is all about like consciousness progression. Like that's what my channel is about. Is um, how to grow. You know how to try and grow your consciousness further. Um, And it's rare, it's rare to find women, it's rare to find women like that, you know, because, like, you know, you may like a woman, you may like how she looks and what she says, for the most part, but, you know, people only look at a pretty face, you know, and think like, oh, yeah, she's, you know, she's talking cute and she's looking cute. You know, and she may be distraught about what's going on, but, you know, and, and you know, she may be an activist or whatever uh, for, you know, for people who don't really, like, treat their children right or whatever, but, like, now it's like you really need to do your due diligence and freaking just research, really, really research on these women online because... Like I said, they're living a double life. All to get the bag. All to have men lust after them and tr to try to give them money. You know, free handouts, right? Just because you look pretty? Oh, 
Oh my god, it doesn't make any sense. So unless she unless she has the proper um, adequate, unless she has the the wherewithal to um just to to not show herself in that way, it's like you really even if she seems all sweet and innocent, she you, you guys really need to do your 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 research. Especially Ringo, it's like he he makes sure that he does, um, you know, back background checks, full background checks on these females because even though you know, even though she may seem sweet and innocent, and and you may agree with like what she has to say and like her topics and everything, um, it still doesn't mean like she's chaste or pure in any form or fashion. You know, just because she says something that you agree with doesn't mean anything. It's like, it's like men now are just sick of it. They're sick of the, they're sick of the games that women play behind their backs. You know, not, not saying, not saying who they, who, who they truly are not you know actions speak louder than words you know and most of the time these women they have they have secret accounts to where you know like Instagram or OnlyFans to where like they're just trying to get any kind of validation they can from men because they're just out here trying to get the bag online I mean that's that's all they're in it for. You know, and I wanted to make this video earlier, but, you know, because I had this thought in mind earlier, I'm like, and I'm listening to a chick on YouTube, you know, and she, you know, you know, she's standing up for men and all of that, and I get it. You know, she wants to be in the good graces of um, her audience, but you don't really know what she's truly doing um, off of YouTube, you know? You don't know what she's truly doing off YouTube, even though she may be saying all the right things. You know, even though you may agree with her on, on, on most topics on her channel. So, if you, come, if you come across a woman or, or a lady, you know, she seems really nice. She, she seems genuine. It's like, don't, don't trust that right off, the, right off the gate. Don't trust that right off the jump. Because, you know... She's, she could be living a double life, you know, just to get money, just to get the bag, you know, from Thirsty Simps online. So I just, I just wanted to state that in a, in a recording. Um, yeah. I mean, only, only your actions will show for it. And, you know, there was this one time, like, where I made a video, and, um, I was doing a cooking video, and, like, I, <laughs> I was just in the house doing my thing, but, like, I was, I was wearing a really short skirt, and, like, by the time I frickin' noticed that on, on the video, I'm like, okay, well, I can't, I can't keep this on my channel, because, um, that's just... You know, that's just, that's just going to make people to like, that's just going to make people want to just view my video just to like, you know, see my ass or just to see my legs. You know what I mean? So I took that video down because I didn't want that, um, I didn't want that showing for people. And I felt embarrassed, even though I was at home just, you know, cooking food. 
when I realized that I saw myself and I was wearing that short of skirt, I'm like, okay, I need to take, I need to take this video down because that's just going to have men like, you know, basically lusting after my behind, you know what I mean? So, and I didn't want to portray myself like that. Because I felt when I made that when I made that video, I you know, it wasn't intentional. That wasn't intentional, but I felt embarrassed. Because people were people were probably looking at my video and only watching my video because I had a short skirt on. You know, it wasn't bringing, like, the overall message that I wanted to um, get out there. Because men are frustrated, you know, they're frustrated. You know, they can't, they can't get a woman to like them. So, um, they result to um, looking at females' bodies because sometimes they think, like, that's all they have is to just look at a woman's body and you know that'll that'll somewhat make them feel better but I didn't I didn't want to portray myself in that in that kind of light because my channel is not about that my channel is about I don't know it's just about growing your consciousness further to think okay well yeah this matrix reality this this matrix reality is bullshit You know, and there was a time where, um, you know, like during like 2012 and, 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 and forward, through the years forward after 2012, like I was getting all these downloads. I was constantly getting these downloads from like the source and everything. And that's, that's basically what my channel is about. Um, I was constantly getting like these light codes um, and you know, what's funny, and that's where you really have to put the work in to, um, to really show people like that you're different. Um, you don't want to be like everybody else. But you know, most, most of these females out here nowadays, like, they just feel like, you know, showing off their body and like how pretty they look, that that's that's all they have. That like that's truly like that's that's truly like all they have is their body and their looks. And there, you know, and there are spineless simps out there who are who would be glad to freaking give their give their all their money away just to see a woman's body. There, there are men out there who would gladly give all their money away to see that, because that's how lonely they are. And these women are deliberately ignoring them because they feel like they have power in their body. That's it. You know, not having like a higher state of mind not having a difference in opinions or anything. This is how the women of today thrive now, is off thirsty men online who just want to like see their body, you know, and say, and say how beautiful and how pretty they are. Um, and men, men are allowing this, like, But in reality, these men out here, they should be, they should be um, reprimanding these, um, these egotistical women. You know, they should be calling them out for their behavior. And most of the time, these men don't even know. Like, they're, they're totally unaware that these women who have YouTube channels, like, they're doing something else. They're doing something else in secret, like, on the side. You know, and and most of the time, like, they don't want you to know about it. They really don't. 
So yeah, I just wanted to get that out there. Um, I don't know what else I want to say. Um, so now that I'm unemployed and I'm just, you know, I'm, and I'm just waiting to go to a few interviews, um, I'm going to be making more videos because I'm unemployed. I don't have a job yet. So I really need to, I really need to try and be vigilant and just, and just go out there and talk to people. Because sometimes applying online for these jobs, like, it's not enough. Like, we're living in a hellhole. We're living in this rat race to where people will, will literally kill just to get anything. Like, if these people would kill to get a job, if, if, if people could kill, you know... And they and they and they see somebody like getting an interview and they and they see that that person could potentially get that position like they you know if people could like they literally would fucking kill that person just to just to get in their spot just to just to have that position that 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 person you know you know if these if these people out here could they would they would do that it's a literal shit show out here and the rat race the rat race is just going to keep continuing you know unless a unless a big meteor strikes the earth or something or something drastic changes or war happens or something other than that nothing's going to change Nothing's going to change. So the rat race out here is brutal. It's really brutal. You know, and if you're an introvert, if you're meek like me, like, like you really need to try like 10 times harder. Because it's cutthroat out here for sure. So, I mean, the least that you, that you, the, the least thing that you, that you should have is some kind of determination. And I know it sucks. It sucks with these people out here because I know that most people, like, have to put on a front, you know. They can't truly be themselves. Otherwise, they won't be liked. They won't be liked by other people. Because you have to have this false sense of identity in order for these people of the matrix to like you. And that's a fact. So if you're a quiet person, if you're a meek person like me, like, you have to try 10 times, 20 times, 30 times harder with all these people out here trying to do the exact same thing that you're doing. And it's a frickin' joke, you know what I mean? It really, it really is hard out here. But anyways, that's all I wanted to say. And I'll post this video up on my channel. Okay, thanks for listening, everyone. Have a good day. And I'll talk to you in the next one. This is Fawn of Sirius, signing out.